awful house. Let's go eat at the awful house. Happy birthday to the birthday girls. Thank you. Thank and, you. Uh, Thank you. I think I should warn you. Cabbage, cauliflower, and onions. Okay? Don't get behind me. Gas mask later. I just found something very important out. Uh, <clears throat> I've never actually worn a bar out on a chain, but I've worn two bars out now. And uh, I'm gonna tell you how you know that your bar is worn out. Uh, number one, here's the old bar. Let me show you this first. Your edges are gonna be mushroomed out. Over the top, you know, where, where the, what I mean is the top edge is going to be rounded over, mushroomed out this way, and you can feel them when you drag your finger across them. You can feel it. Plus, the channel, the groove that the chain rides in is going to be wore wider than, uh, and I'll show you how, you how you know. You wiggle this back and forth. You see how very little this wiggles? Very little. I'm going to put this on the other bar and I'll show you when I come back all right here's the new bar you see how much this is wiggling so I was having trouble with this cutting and uh, new bar is gonna fix it okay here's an even better example That's way too much wiggle. And uh, I think you can probably see this mushroomed over edge. I'll tell you what, let me get this off and I'll show it to you. All right, this is what it's supposed to look like. Barely any movement. Now, here is the, uh, can you see the curled over edge right here? Now you can take a file and file this all down. But by the time you've got a curled over edge, the channel, the groove the chain rides in is probably wore out too. So it's just not worth it. For the price of a bar, you know, you're saving yourself a, I guess you gotta balance your time. And uh, I can't bend over for long, so I gotta use my, whatever little bit of bending over I got in me, I gotta use for cutting not messing around trying to get this thing through a piece of wood. So, uh, there's a good, see, you can see the curled over edge there. And that's what I'm talking about. Made in Germany. Okay, that's my little bit of chainsaw knowledge, just passing it on. While I'm here, let's have a look at that air filter. Yeah, I'll blow that off while I'm here. Thanks for watching.